Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, I'm Tiff. I'm an American living in Paris. And today we're talking about my favorite topic ever, which is fashion and style. So today I will be sharing some of my favorite French fashion brands with you guys. I literally could not believe that I haven't made this video for you guys sooner. But since living in Paris, I definitely have discovered some really, really cool brands. Most of them I do believe are available in the United States as well. Um, so I will be doing a little fashion show for you guys, showing off some of my favorite items that I've gotten from French fashion brands here and I will put a link in my description box to the outfits that I'm sharing with you guys today so if the item is available I'll put a link to the item if it's not available I'll try and find a similar item and if I can't find a similar item I'll just put a link to the brand itself um, but I will do what I can to make sure you have all of the details of the items that I'm sharing with you guys today so now let's get into what some of my favorite French fashion brands are and make sure to comment below what your favorite outfit is that I'm sharing with you guys today now let's get into it So the very first brand I have for you is Bash. I got this super cute bohemian style dress from this brand. I love this dress because you can pair it with sneakers for a cute summer look or pair it with boots and a leather jacket for a fall winter look. And this brand is actually one of my go-tos for Parisian style. I swear whenever I wear this dress, people say I'm dressing like a Parisian. They're known for their modern, feminine pieces and are also all about the bohemian look. I was obsessed with this dress when I found it, I just had to have it. Next up is Maj. I love this brand. It's super Parisian, super feminine. They offer a lot of wardrobe staples like the shirt dress that I got from them during the Paris sales. They're known for their bold, modern, and urban fashion. I love this dress because you can wear it so many different ways, without a belt or with this brown belt that actually came with the dress. And sometimes I even like to add a simple black waist belt to it. I love to play around with this dress and look for fun accessories to pair it with. Then I also got this really cute blouse from Maj. I was obsessed with the sleeves. They're super feminine and perfect for a night out. Here I'm wearing it with shorts, but it also looks really cute with skinny jeans and booty heels. And fun fact for you guys, they actually have a Maj outlet in the 18 arrondissement in Paris where you can get pieces from Maj at a discount all year long. Next up is Ann Other Stories, which is where I got this sweater from. And Ann Other Stories actually has headquarters in Sweden, but they do have an atelier in Paris where they produce designs to reinvent the iconic French girl. So I definitely wanted to make sure that I included them on this list. I also got the boots that I'm wearing with this outfit from Ann Other Stories. I wear them all of the time, they're my go-to. And then I also got this black chunky turtleneck sweater from Ann Other Stories. I love, love, love this sweater. You can never go wrong with the black turtleneck. It's definitely a staple in my wardrobe. Oh my God, and I'm literally over myself right now because I just realized I didn't tuck in the pocket in my pants. Oops. I also got this super, super cute pearl detailed sweater from In Other Stories. So here I dressed it down with G's and Converse, but also super easy to dress up as well. Definitely one of my favorite sweaters in my closet by far. And honestly guys, and Other Stories has been my go-to for sweaters this season. They have so many that are super cozy and super trendy.
Then next up is Ma Trotter. I actually discovered this brand over the summer. I got this super cute printed skirt from there and I wear it so many different ways. So here I'm wearing it with a belted chunky sweater with sneakers for a casual look. You can also tuck the sweater in for a cute look. But this brand draws a lot of their inspiration from travel and street style, which I absolutely love. And then I discovered that they had a top to match the skirt and I was all over it. I love, love, love this look. I wear it with sneakers or with boots. And here goes my black waist belt again. I love it with my black waist belt. And it also works to wear this with a leather jacket like this one that I got from my next brand, which is Claudie Pierlo. So Claudie Pierre Lowe offers a lot of classic styles, um, which is why I got my leather jacket from them. I just needed an easy, simple leather jacket, so they were my go-to. And apparently the designer, Claudie Pierre Lowe, wanted to create a maison for Parisian women. And I would say out of all of the brands mentioned, this is probably the most classic. It's known for its chic, effortless pieces. And I, of course, went with one of the most classic pieces of them all, this leather jacket. And then next up is Sandro. So this is another luxury brand that I absolutely love. I don't yet have too many pieces from Sandro, um, but I do know that the brand aims to represent the cool, chic Parisian spirit and the effortlessness elegance of French style. So this jacket is actually vintage and I got it my very first year living in Paris. So I've had it for a while. I love, love, love the look of it. I love the color. I love that it's moto style. It's definitely one of my favorite jackets in my wardrobe. And I actually got this Sandro jacket from Violet Sauvage, which I'm not sure if too many people know about it, but it's basically a huge thrift event in Paris where sellers come together and sell their secondhand luxury goods. So I was in heaven, you literally only pay two euros to get in and you have access to all of these designer goods like Chanel, Versace, Prada, like the list goes on. And it's where I got my Sandro jacket and I got it for less than a fourth of the price, which is insane. I was so excited to find this jacket. So Violet Sauvage is definitely something that you should check out if you are coming to Paris. So I'll put the link to Violet Sauvage in my description box in case you guys wanna check them out. But oh my gosh, definitely something to check out if you're coming to Paris. So guys, what was your favorite look that I showed you? Um, let me know in the comments below. I honestly can't decide, I have so many favorites. But that's a wrap on what some of my favorite French fashion brands are. These are brands that I'm absolutely loving right now. And honestly, I do have to say, I feel like my style has evolved since living in Paris. And when I first came here, I did expect people to be a lot more glammed up than they actually are. You know, you know, kind of like the glam that they show in TV shows and movies about Paris, but it's really not like that. I feel like the Parisian look is a lot more effortlessly chic, you know, with muted tones versus kind of super glammed up. And honestly, if I do see someone that's over the top glam, I'm kind of like, okay, you're either not from here or you're just in town for fashion week. So definitely something to keep in mind if you are planning on traveling or moving to Paris and not sure kind of what type of wardrobe to pack. Um, people really aren't super super glam from head to toe I mean of course if you go to the fancier places in Paris they might be but everyday look it's definitely effortlessly chic and it's also been really cool to see how my style has changed in the different cities that I've lived in so in San Francisco it was one look in New York City it was one look and then in Paris it totally evolved as well um, so that's something that's been really cool for me to see as well and guys let me know if you'd like to see more fashion and style content for me this video was so much fun to make and honestly fashion and style was my very first love like I was that kid after back to school shopping that would do an entire fashion show for the family. That was me. Um, so I love this stuff. It's definitely something that I'm super into. So let me know if you want to see more fashion and style content from me because I'd love to share. Well guys, that's it for me. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon.